Hey everybody, happy Wednesday. Mark Cozzi here from Black Cat Comics in Rockin' Milpitas. Every Wednesday is New Comic Day and I like to give you some great reasons to get down to your local comic shop and pick up something fun to read. It's another pretty small week, but as always, some great stuff to talk about. Gonna start with the Marvel guys this week because this is Darth Vader number eight. I just recently got caught up on all the Star Wars stuff and it's just as awesome as I'd hoped it would be. All the stuff's selling like crazy. Darth Vader's been really awesome. That gal on the cover there is one of the newer characters to the new Star Wars universe. A lot to check out in these books, so pick up the Black Cat Pack for the first six issues or just grab number seven. Darth Vader's great stuff. All that Star Wars stuff's been a lot of fun. There are 12 uh, Secret Wars books this week. Age of Apocalypse. That's your Wolverine and X-Men book. Amazing Spider-Man, Renew Your Vows. For all of you who are still a little bitter about all that Mephisto stuff from a few years ago. Civil War number two. A lot of buzz about Captain America 3. The old Civil War, this book. Great stuff. Future Imperfect. One of my favorites of all this stuff because I love the maestro. Giant Size. Little AVX. Your Scotty Young book of the week. That's been a lot of fun. Guardians of Nowhere. It's your Guardians of the Galaxy book, along with Guardians Team Up, which you'll see in just a second. Infinity Gauntlet. Probably one of your favorites of all this uh, Secret War stuff, because everybody loves Thanos. Miss Marvel wrapping up. This book has been huge. So if you haven't been following along, you might want to grab these last couple issues, see what all the hubbub's about. Or you might just want to pick up the first trade paperback. The book's been excellent. Uh, Red Skull is your Captain America book of the week, along with another one that you'll see in just a sec. Siege number two. Spider Island. And Ultimate End with your main man, Miles Morales, right there on the cover. Rounds out all your Secret Wars stuff. But there's just a couple others. Bucky Barnes, The Winter Soldier, is your other cat book of the week. It's another title that's wrapping up. Groot, you can read more about this one in our newsletter. Always love anything with the Silver Surfer. And the aforementioned Guardians team up. Obviously has Spider-Man this time around. I encourage you guys to pick up the last issue with Groot and Silver Surfer. Star-Lord and Spider-Man is always awesome. So great week for the Marvel guys. Very small week for the DC guys, but the beginning of the next round of Bombshell covers kicks off this week. This is Batman Detective Comics. Cool Bombshell Huntress there. And Green Lantern 43 is your other Bombshell Book of the Week. This time around we get the guys, so that's pretty cool. It's going to be different Bombshells every week this, week, this month. So make sure you check those out. And of course, there's regular covers for all these books, too. Batman Beyond and Batmite rounds out your Bat Stuff of the Week. Love Batmite and uh, Bizarro, a couple of all-ages humor books DC's got going on right now. Always encouraging you guys to pick up something on the lighter side. Justice League, Gods and Monsters. This is the Wonder Woman one. We've already had the Batman and Superman, in case you missed him. Still got him in stock. Doesn't she look like Big Barda there? Midnighter rounds out your DC proper. As I said, it's not a big week for the New 52 universe, or the former New 52 universe, I should say. Injustice starts the new arc of year four. And Flash Season Zero, world's newest, biggest TV star. <clears throat> rounds out your DC Comics books this week. Like I say, not much from them, but some good stuff. Great week for my friends at Dark Horse. Always love to see an Angel and Faith. That's your Whedonverse book of the week. My favorite of the bunch. Of course, I love Buffy, but Angel and Faith is a really solid book. Good characters, good story, good art. Baltimore is your Mignola book of the week because you know I always got one. This one doesn't relate to the Hellboy stuff, unlike Hellboy, Abe Sapien, Lobster Johnson, BPRD all of his other awesome titles. But of course, I still encourage you to pick up Baltimore because you should be reading anything from Mike Mignola. And Red Sonia Conan is your Dark Horse slash Dynamite book of the week. Cool Alex Ross cover. This is the second volume. The previous one was Conan Red Sonia. Always encouraging you guys to have a Dark Horse book on your list. Great week for the Image guys too. Some of their top people. How about my main man Rick Remender and Deadly Class? I like anything from Rick Remender. It's 
book you should be checking out. Outcast from a guy who does a book called Walking Dead. We Stand on Guard from Brian K. Vaughn who did a book called Why the Last Man. That's probably one you're looking for. And The Wicked and the Divine. Another one of the big image books. Everybody's been waiting for the next issue. Big week for those guys. And a great week for Dynamite Comics. I don't say as much about Dynamite as I should. This guy is Bob's Burgers number two. The second round of Bob's Burgers comics. You love the show. You love the first uh, series enough to make them want to create a second one. Uh, once again, written by the same writers who do the, the show for Cartoon Network. So, of course, it's awesome. Gotta love Bob's Burgers. And a couple of classics from Dynamite. This is The Shadow. First issue of his new series. And the next issue of The Spirit. From all-time great Will Eisner. Everybody should know who The Spirit is. Have this book on their list. You should just send checks to the Will Eisner family because he's awesome. Great week for the Dynamite guys. And a small but excellent week for kids books. First of all, I talk about Big Thunder Mountain Railroad because that's my Disney book of the week. I love the roller coaster. I love the comic. I love westerns. I love kids books all in one. And a couple of regular show books this week. That's the issue number 26 because you know I love regular show. Anything with skips. And this is the Noir Means Noir graphic novel. All original, all new content, super sized. So if you're a regular show fan like me, you'll want to pick that up. Great stuff. Like I say, not a huge week, but lots and lots of great stuff. So check those shipping lists. Get down to your shop. Pick up something super awesome. Want to mention that we're here at 73 North Milpitas for just a few more weeks. Come by and check out uh, the original location uh, just before we uh, finish the move over to the new spot uh, over at 176 South Main. Uh, so yeah, you subscribers will continue to pick up your books here. we got all our new releases here, same as always for the next few weeks. That's all i got for you for this week. You can check us out on Facebook where you can read our newsletter and watch this crazy video. Uh, check us out at blackcatcomics.biz where you can update your subscription list or send in a new one. Uh, check out our YouTube channel or just get on down here to Rockin' Milpitas. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next week.